Hi, my swannies, and welcome to Not Your Type of ASMR. Now, today is going to be a really different video, and it's in regards to my cameo with Be Love. A lot of people wanted to know how it was and was it worth the $100 that I paid. Well, guess what? It was worth more and then some. This lady was very personal with me. I mean, she congratulated me for graduating college. She was very personal and I felt like I've known her for years, okay? And she made me feel so comfortable. And when she went over my channel, it was just little things that needed to be done and I did take her advice and I am winning. Be loved, just in case you want to know your advice was very good and thank you so I see no reason why people are bashing such a wonderful person because when I tell you that I have paid for cameos before and neither one of them was a hundred dollars okay so this was pretty much practically a steal okay because cameos just they're not a hundred dollars okay when you getting with some of these big celebrities or whatever cameos are not a hundred dollars hun they're like a thousand two and it's just for like if they get your whole name out it's good okay and you really can't complain okay but this lady goes out of her way and she goes on your channel she sees what it is you need to do and she's very personal everything that comes out of her mouth is very positive there's nothing negative to come out of her mouth okay so I made this video because I wanted to let people know that, look, you all are tripping. You're tripping. I mean, if you're serious about YouTube the way that I am, and I'm sure that I have a lot of, you know, friends or whatever that does YouTube that is serious about YouTube, then $100 investing in yourself is not a bad thing. It's actually a good thing, especially when you have someone as big as B-Love to look over your work and to tell you what you need to do. That is really good. And then let me tell y'all something. Okay, are y'all ready for this? She has a little book in the front of her with everything that you need to do in regards to your channel. And she goes over what she finds and she helps you. I mean, since I had my cameo and since I've taken her advice, I have been growing. And I thank you for that, beloved. I thank you for my new subscribers that come to my channel. I thank you all for that. I thank you old subscribers for sticking with me. I thank you all for that. And I just want you all to know that this is a channel of positive. There's nothing negative going on here. So if you come here looking for some beloved drama, this is not where you're going to find it because I love her to death. And I don't just love her because she did my cameo. I love her because I've been following her for a long time. Okay, since she did her YouTube a long time ago. I've been following her and she have been the same person. Because some people that get big or whatever, they tend to change. But this woman never changed. She always has this goofy smile on her face. And she always out eats her family. Always. I mean, Nate, her kids... They can't hang, okay? She always out eats them. And she don't be looking full. You know what I'm saying? And she has this personality and she smiles and it's just so, so good. You know, she makes you feel so good. It's like an old friend or something just coming through and just giving you some encouraging words, you know? So I'm here to say this. Stop with the drama. When someone's out there that's willing to help, especially in this time, in this pandemic, you know, if you're trying to do something with your life, you're trying to get a YouTube, then this is pretty much a blessing, okay? And don't get me wrong, if you don't have the money, cool. It's okay if you don't have the money. But don't be ugly because you don't have the money and someone else is willing to, you know, spend their money on something that they want to invest in, which is their future. It's not that bad. It's not that bad at all. It's not even that serious where anyone should have went on her channel and said some ugly things to her. Because we all know we're in a pandemic. We all know that. We all have choices. Okay? And when I'm talking about choices, you have a choice to where you want to invest your money. You have a choice where you want to spend your money. You will have a choice to do whatever you want to do with your money. But for those that are investing in themselves, then do not, I repeat, do not say nothing bad about them. Do not bash them because they're invested. You can get a, a whole lot of food with this. Mm -hmm, you sure can. And later on, when you become, you know, who you want to be because you have invested in yourself and you're continuing to invest in yourself, you can have plenty of food with that. Okay? It's not that big of a deal. It's not that serious. And I am very, very, very 
very, I cannot stress enough, very displeased with some of the things that had been said, you know, and I am late jumping on this because I just don't do drama, but I read so many ugly comments, so I felt like I should get on here and to, you know, say how my cameo went. It was perfect. My daughter was like, mom, oh my God, this woman is amazing. And she didn't even know her. Didn't even know. She said, I watch this her. And I was wondering if she was the same, you know, on camera. And she brought the same energy. So this is so sweet. And we watched it over and over and over and over again. Because I'm like, okay, she cannot possibly be this just goofy all the time and sweet. You know, it's, it's so genuine, people. And you have so many rare people in this land of living with that same personality. It is very rare that you have people like B-Love that is that sweet and always have something kind to say. So by all means, let's embrace that. You know, let's embrace the ones that are, you know, willing to help. She don't have to do this. Just like you don't have to give your $100. You can always give your opinion, but don't bash anyone. You know, it's, it's okay. Freedom of speech. It's freedom of everything. Freedom of everything. Don't get me wrong. Freedom of everything. But stop being ugly. Because at the end of the day, we're all God's children. Okay? And he watches us. He sees our actions. Okay? And I'm talking to those that, you know, believe in a higher power. Believe in the Lord. And I'm not bashing those that do not believe in him. Whatever you believe in. But I'm talking about good in general. Good is going to always outweigh the bad. Good is going to always deplete evilness. And it's nothing to say thank you. And it's nothing to say, well, I don't have it right now, but you know what? You're doing such a wonderful job helping individuals get to where they want to be. And I really appreciate you. And so I just wanted to make this video because I appreciate you, beloved. I do. I really do. And I really appreciate the fact that you gave me a congratulations on my degree, girl. Yes, I got the degree. And I did, you know, my daughter did a little walking for me. She did a little ceremony and I walked in the house and it was just great. We painted the car where everyone seen that, hey, mommy graduated and she's 45 years old they made a big deal out of it and so i had so much fun on my graduation day but i am very pleased with your cameo i am very pleased not only with that but because of the personality that you keep in the video that you also keep in your videos i am so pleased with you and if you get a looking at this video and i said a looking because i'm a country girl but if you get to see this video just know that susan swan appreciates you and I want you to just keep doing you, girl. Keep doing you. Because at the end of the day, they talked about the good Lord. And what he said, Father, forgive them because they know not what they say. And he just kept on about his business. So you keep doing you, okay? Keep doing you because you are amazing. And from me and my, my family, we love you. And we want to say, God bless, love you, and there's nothing you can do about it.